Genesis 3:24. God expelled Adam and Eve from the garden. God stationed an angel at the entrance to the tree of life. Man was prohibited from accessing the tree of life. In the new, Jerusalem. Those who have been saved will eat from the tree of life. We will have new resurrected bodies that will obtain glory from the fruit from the tree of life. The Old Testament is filled with the history of man and his supernatural encounters. Genesis 6:12. And God looked upon the earth. And the whole earth was cruel and wicked. The earth was filled with violence. I will judge the earth, said God. I will destroy them. For 120 years Noah told the wicked people that God was bringing judgment. They continued in their violent and wicked and cruel ways. They were destroyed in the flood. God saved, only Noah and his family and the animals that were on the ark. The flood judgment destroyed all the wicked people. Noah and his family and the animals were safe on the ark. God had told the people what was going to happen but they didn't believe. The flood water covered the whole earth. It completely buried the highest mountains way underwater. Every person drowned. Except for Noah and his family and their animals on the ark. Enjoying the rainbow after the flood. The population of the new earth began with just the three wives of Noah's three sons. One of these women is your ancestor. Your way way back, grandmother. She believed God and was saved. We are saved if we believe in God's Son and what He did on the cross to save us from our sins. Jesus is our Savior and Lord and King. Nimrod challenging God from the height of his new tower. God! From here I will rule. Not you. Nimrod presenting his plan. Nimrod with direct access to demonic intelligence. And satanic power. Would be invincible without divine intervention. God confused the language of the people on earth. They separated and established different nations. Nimrod means let us rebel. Everyone I can't understand, I kill. Abraham was looking for a city whose maker and builder is God. God's people are looking for the same city. The New Jerusalem. Jesus said he was preparing it. It is almost finished. Are you ready? David was a youth when God gave him the supernatural ability to kill Goliath the giant. David giving his credentials to Goliath. I come to you in the name of the Lord. Elijah was taken to heaven by God in a supernatural chariot of fire. Elisha was watching. Elisha was the man God used after Elijah was taken alive into heaven. We are going to be taken to heaven alive. Those who are saved will be raptured. Probably very soon. Elisha the prophet followed God. After he died a dead man was dropped into Elisha's grave. The dead man resurrected as soon as he touched Elisha's bones. Praise God! An invading force of 185,000 was supernaturally put to death by the angel of the Lord. 2 Kings 19.35 The three friends of Daniel were supernaturally sustained in the fiery furnace. Thank you Jesus! Daniel was thrown into the den of lions. He was supernaturally protected. Simba, roll over. 150 years before Cyrus was born, Isaiah the prophet named him as the Persian king who would invade and conquer Babylon. Isaiah chapter 45. Daniel and Cyrus just after Cyrus entered Babylon. Cyrus, we have been expecting you, for 150 years, let me show you the writings of our prophet Isaiah. <laughs> 